Hey YouTube. So I'm out and about on a uh, glorious sunny Sunday day. Just taking the uh, the bike for a little bit of a spin. Make the most of the dry roads, which is uh, pretty much the first time they've been uh, pretty much dry for uh, a long, long time. Well, no, it's glorious. There's the cow crop. Not great when you land over. I suppose you get that from living in areas where there's farms though. Really had chance today to uh, to feel how the suspension is since I last uh, posted a video last week. That was when I had the suspension set up, and I'm just on my way up to uh, towards Devil's Bridge. So as you can see, the MT. Wheel is first and second, pretty easy. Um, absolute animal, but I love it. Temperature out today is a uh, crisp 7 degrees, which is uh, warmer than it's been in the past. And I believe we're having snow next week in the UK. Uh, or at least the south of UK is getting snow first. Not sure it will reach us up north. But you never know. They did forecast for next Friday, Saturday. So I'm making the most of the uh, glorious uh, blue sky and sunshine that we've got today. It's the second bike I've ever owned that I absolutely love to bits. And it's comfortable. It's got enough power to do what you want. Um, it's just great. I see a lot more people buying SPs now. I don't know what the sales in Yamaha are statistic-wise compared to the standard. But it's, a, uh, it's an all-round great bike. It's comfy, upright seating position, bags of power, hooligan machine, but can also be very tame. And uh, you can also tour on it as well. So it's a pretty good uh, all-round bike, and that's what I wanted. So we're just coming into Kirby Lonsdale now. And uh, this is the road that takes you up towards Ingleton and... Uh, there's an actual uh, route that goes from uh, from here up through Ingleton um, and up to Hawes and uh, some really nice riding roads um, over the mountain that you can see in the distance there. Really, really lovely roads. Uh, it's 3.45 in the afternoon. I might actually have a run up there. All right, can I get a coffee? White, one sugar? Thank you. Cheers now. So this is Devil's Bridge. Really nice place, especially in summer when it's nice and hot. You can have a picnic down there next to the water. And uh, in summer, you used to get a lot of people jumping off the bridge here uh, into the river below. Although they try and stop you now because a lot of people have been hurt from the rocks. Uh, there's only a narrow gap when you look down from where they jump from at the bridge. 
Let me just look over the edge. You can see the rocks on the water. It's not very deep, there's only about a 12 foot gap in the middle. So some crazy people still do it. But it's quite nice, nice area. You've got all this uh, beautiful surroundings. I don't know if you can pick it up on the camera there, the rocks below the water. River's coming off the mountain. It's very cold even in summer. Um, but it's a lovely area. You've got a lot of picnic tables and areas where you can have a barbecue in summer up uh, on the, uh, the grassy bits there. And even go for a swim. But I won't be doing that today. So this is Devil's Bridge, a local bike haunt, and uh, as you can see, the hot snack bar. Cheers. So, onward. I don't know what the hell that is, kit car or something. Close that visor, get rid of all that wind. So let's have a run towards Ingleton and uh, make the most of the, uh, the sunlight before it goes today. So, yeah, Devil's Bridge gets quite busy in summer. So, Devil's Bridge, um, it gets quite busy in summer. Hundreds of bikes can be, uh, be parked up there on a Sunday or a Saturday when the, the weather's warmer and they come from all over, east coast, west coast. So if you've liked this video and uh, want to see more road trips, tours, reviews, then uh, click below, leave a comment, subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.